you know, we can get them blueprints so we can um, have sexy time with uh, weird things in the dark room. It's so hot. Alright. Alright, come on, come on, keep walking. Um. I don't think I need to be in here to do the call, but it just feels appropriate. Beep up, beep up, boop, boop, beep up. 125 drop frames, or 0 0.1. That happened when the Skyrim download was happening at the very beginning of the stream. So I think, we, I think we're good now. Talk to that BDSM couple then. There we go. Well, what exactly would I be looking for? I believe Prince would I be looking for? Hmm. We had fun with this one. And her, and her, her, and her. So, we, we basically ran the gamut. And this one's from Golden Axe, I thought that was hilarious. Hilarious. Oh, maybe this one? in the blueprint. Ah, oh, ha, 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 ha. Okay, so I've got to talk to that dude where I, I destroyed his uh, drone. Yeah, yeah, that, that obviously makes sense. glasses again. Okay, I guess it's not him. Blue glasses. Oh, you. Right. You get the, um, the VIP to get the, um, right. But I want to know if you can get the other uh, blueprint. Whatever, whatever. Oh, Sinistubbin. Hey, what's up, dude? Yeah. 
Uh, let's get Luciani for uh, Mr. Stefan. Sinistuff was streaming the game. Retro. Retro on Twitch? It's more likely than you think. Yeah. I'm just hanging out on, on my, my Saturday. Just chilling. Hope you're well, dude. I think you're playing, like, what, Sega games recently? Like, it's, it's, been, it's been a hot minute since I popped in. Like, I know that you stream quite regularly. But, yeah. Right now I'm playing a game called uh, Virtual Verse. I think I'll finish this stream. It's just a point and click adventure, but I've um, it's been sitting in my Steam library for like a year, so I've been wanting to uh, nail this one. Hidden cryptos. Triple A access, nice. Is that it? Alright. Got a crypto wallet full of crypto coins. Nice. I got the all access pass, so now I can finally see Jade. talk to this person again and say this is bullshit I can't get backstage nice damn it well time to speed this along ah control sound okay No way, take a look at this. Alright. Pull of cans. Pick it up. Damn it. Ashtray. What we got here? Chewing gum. Can we take it? Can we put it in our mouth? No? Alright. Oh wait. Okay, we've we got full surveillance. A nerd. 3D printed chair, what? Oh, is this um from um Day of the Tentacle or something like that? If so, that's pretty cool throwback. Okay, so, I think we've got to talk to this guy. Fuck around with him a little bit. Let's look at him. It's going to take, he's not a pro. Ah, 
took 10 days to make the chair. Interesting. Oh. Banya. Okay, so maybe... I thought it was uh, the tentacle from, you know, Maniac Mansion and uh, David the Tentacle, but... Banya. Ah, okay, so it's basically like the, um, it's homage to the alien-looking thing right in the middle of the screen. Okay. Oh god, a retail corpus droid, what? I want to say it's this middle one, but... Ah, uh, let's try that. <laughs> oh, this is from, um, 2001 A Space Odyssey, yeah? Oh god. I mean, it's been years since I watched that movie, and I certainly didn't, like, pay attention to that detail. I think it's, um, either two or three. Better four and sounds like it's rough, but I don't know. I don't know. But the answers are... Oh, am I? Okay, okay, okay. I'm just going to go with this. Damn it. Picard? Yep, yep, yep. That's from uh, Star Trek The Next Generation. Okay. That'd be Riker. Oof. One out of 3,000. That'd be alright. Okay. Let's, uh, let's, let's, let's save. Let's try that again. Okay, boop, 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 boop. Boop, 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 boop. Let's go. Oh, did, did he not? Because I failed the, uh, the quiz, am I going to be screwed out of it? Oh, the blueprint's gonna be a Vanya, I reckon. Yeah, that would make sense. Yeah, dark room. Nice. Right. <laughs> yeah. All right, all right. We might be able to use the poster as the blueprint for the um the thing. That sounds reasonable. I mean, none of this is reasonable, but... Is there anything? Anything else? Wait, 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 um... Take a picture. No! No. Skip, skip scene. Uh, X. Skipped it. Haha. -ha. Fuck you, game. I can't drag this. 
I can't drag this. Damn it. Ah, you are back. Hello, life. Yes, I am. I did some hacker magic on my Raspberry Pi. I was watching Stranger Days. Stranger Days. <laughs> Strange Days. Interesting. Was it at like uh, 1080p or 720p? Like, I could only squeeze so much out of the earlier Raspberry Pis, personally. It's something I should really look into. I've got three of the damn things, but... You know, it's just, it's just time and effort, you know? Right now, we're trying to figure out how to get uh, Vanya's blueprint. But, um... I don't think I'm getting much success here. I have a, a 4B with 4 gigabyte. Mm. So I, I can't use this. Oh wait, no, is it again? No, you're on the... Damn it. How come I was able to use it then? That's weird. Oh well, time to uh, cheat again. So it's automatic, okay. Or did I skip that entire cutscene? Interesting. I think I skipped that entire cutscene. That's not good. I didn't want to do that. So let's load up this. Okay, we've had a chat with him. The trick is to use two separate operating systems, regular Raspbian for most of it, then a Kodi-based OS called Libra Elect. That one plays nice with TVs and you can control it from the TV remote. Interesting. It sounds like you'd have to invest some time in it to it, but it sounds like it works as intended, so that's nice. Alright, so let's... Let's call this dude. Let's not skip the cutscene this time. You might like this life. They got the um, 56k broadband sound when you connect to the internet. never not be an iconic sound. It's not quite the sound of a 56k motor. Like, let's be real on that. It's very close though. Oh right, of course, I'm a fan of this, isn't she's actually... For you, only... Damn. <laughs> it do be like this though. I wonder if any of these phone systems can actually interface with old modems now. Maybe. I reckon like either on Reddit or YouTube, there'll be someone that's like done a project like that. I mean, who even has a landline anymore? I think, uh, no, we don't. We did in our old home, like we, we kept it just because, but yeah. There's your money. Money received. Transferring blueprint data to your phone. Bye. 
Alright. Alright, sick, sick. Alright, so now it's time to go to the uh, deep room. I mean, even if you do, it's voiceover IP based from the router. Yeah. That's pretty much how it. Yeah. There's no true landline anymore. Alrighty. It's time. And we know that this is going to distract the uh, guy because uh, we know that he monitors these rooms for security purposes. Alright. Alright. Where are you? It's gonna be the next one. Here we go. Thank you, Mr. Magoo. It's actually... That's some great ass that... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I bet when I tell that nerd about this upgrade, it's going to blow his mind. Yeah, um... What it seems to be with the green screen, the main issue was lighting. And I, I had known this. Um, so I've got the, the ceiling light working. But yeah, now that I've got... It's a cheap light. It's not an expensive one, but now that I've got that... I've, I've actually got two. But the way that it's set up, like, it takes USB as the power source. And I'm, I'm basically, like, I don't have enough power plugs to put the second light where I need it to be. So at the moment, like, yeah. You're looking good. But it's definitely looking better than it was before. I was, like, um, concerned that even though I bought this... Um, Elgato green screen, the portable green screen. I was concerned that the uh, the chroma key, the um, the actual color of the green wasn't deep enough of a green. So I was kind of getting pissed off, and I was like, "What am I doing wrong? It's the lighting." I still think, I still think it's not as green as what it, um, earlier versions of this screen were. If you have a look at Amazon, like some people have been doing some comparisons, but um, yeah. Yes, it's definitely looking clean. No, no, solid green color works. And running the comments on the bottom of the screen is really good. Yeah, I think so too. The ticket takes up way less space. I agree. I agree. All made possible from a guy called um, Mr. Boost. Um, he releases widgets um, on the Stream Elements website. One of them being the minimalist side-scrolling uh, chat box so if you need to look for that sort of stuff look for like stream elements mr. boost on YouTube there should be tutorials about it so now let's talk to this nerd I reckon he was watching me having sex with this uh, space queen I reckon he put that on a, on a, on a, a floppy disk Oh uh, yes, the dark room, yes. There we go. Loving your great stuff, thank you. Did you see the new entry in the dark room? So that's not um all these little changes. Like, I consider them entrees to the main course. The main course is going to be when I eventually get my new microphone. And it's going to be connected to this uh, Rode boom arm. Then shit's going to get serious. But I don't get that, um... I don't get the, uh, the microphone until the 14th. And I have my leg surgery on the 14th, so... Yeah. But I'm looking forward to it. 
they'll definitely up the quality of my audio. And really, the quality of the audio, it's, it's like so important to the stream. So, it's going to be a um, HyperX Dual Cast S, I believe. It's, it's going to be nice. It's going to be really nice. What's happening with the leg, knee, vein removal? It's going to be vein removal. Um, or vein ablation. Ablation is where you um, heat the inside of the vein so that it collapses upon itself and then it, it's eventually cannibalized within the body. So apparently the human body has two vein systems, like one artery system and one, uh, two vein systems. So you can ablate one of the vein systems. Like the way it was explained is that, you know, um, it's not as bad of a thing as it used to be and that, you know, it's, it's a managed condition. And so my condition has progressed. So, uh, yeah, I, I don't think because I've got less veins, I'm not going to be a pro athlete anytime soon. So heaps of people need it over time. Yeah, I mean... If you, if you feel like there's something weird going on with your legs or your body, it could be vein related and you should definitely get a, a referral to a specialist. I'd recommend that to anyone. Especially when you see, um, like if, if there's pain, if there's, if there's actual pain, see someone immediately. Heaps of people need it over time. When my father did it, they had to strip that stuff out, yeah. So like I had the, the choice of vein stripping or EVLT, endovenous laser ablation treatment. And I, of course, chose the second. Provena. I think it's right up Alley. All right, this is, this is where we tell the nerd about the, uh, the sexy time he can have with his uh, Emmy Queen. Oh, hell yeah, he's checking out the recordings. Oh, what? Wait. He's recording them? He's not just monitoring them, he's recording them. Wow. Look better with the lights? Yeah, I think so. Like, when you compare them to the, um, the, the older VODs, um, I had to pull down the, um, the color saturation and put all sorts of things, but, yeah, with the lighting, um, you can really make the uh, the chroma key much better. I was um, quite surprised that lighting affected it so much, but you know, here we are. This game seems to have a lot of scenes, but is there any actual serious driving plot now besides finding your girlfriend? We're about, I want to say halfway through, so I think that that exposition is going to be laid out on us pretty soon. Life, but yeah. I think I see that. Lovely. Speaking of which, I have seen that you have had some streams lately, Mr. Medu. I think you are playing Off the Path Traveler, weren't you? Yeah, and some other retro. So it's good that you've uh, decided to, um, you know, at least test what you've got. No, no, I just test. Oh, that's fair enough. Every, everyone, like, if you're interested in watching um, a different streamer, check out Mr. Magoo. What can I say? Did you try out Red Strings Club? Not yet. That's another point and click that's on the uh, the list. But I've got a lot of games, dude. I've got a lot of games. All right. So let's let's see this this guy's uh, reaction. This is a violation of privacy. Privacy. No one cares about this shit anymore. So true. Red Strings isn't really point and click. Oh wait. Okay. Holy shit. <laughs> I've been waiting for this ever since I got this job. Oh, this guy's about to have uh, his happy time. It's more of a series of mini games that are text heavy. Mm. So I can go for some good old in there. Mm. So he's about to uh, have some fun time with his alien queen, Venya. 